All right, here we are taking a look at this pet want smart pet feeder over here on top. You pressed to open the lid. As simple as that. You got some buttons here. Alarm, the mic to set link and power and the container where you put the food. You got the camera over here, HD camera. This is where the food comes out. And this is the plate, dog plate right here. Let's see how it works. All right, let's pour some food down. So this is a nice device because this guy over here will eat everything he finds. This is the man right here. It is easy to install. Um, if you follow the step, step by step, it'll be easy for you. Don't try to do it on your own. Just follow the steps. Over here you have the QR code. Just get a QR reader from the iPad or iPhone and start. QR code reader. It says open URL, English, app download for iOS, open app. So it has loaded the app, this one right here. Let's go ahead and get it and install. So it's downloading app right now. This is the one and let's jump to that. All right, let's go to the second phase. I have plugged in. Now turn it on the bottom here, button. It says alarm. Now the instructions here says open the app. I open the app here. Allow. Register your account or you could log in with Facebook or Twitter. I couldn't log in by registering so the app has some issues because it's just a new app. But um, you could register with Facebook or Twitter. Let's do that. So I have connected with Facebook. I have to, I turned it on already. Now I have to press the set, set button until the link light is blinking. All right, the link light is blinking. Let's hit next now. Next. Look for your network and put your password. Find your network, put the password for the network and press next. All right, now go to the settings on the Wi-Fi, look for PetWant, connect to pen, PetWant there. All right, now return to the app and click next. So it should be connecting now. So now the app, your device is connecting to the smart pet feeder. All right, so now this is so successfully connect this, let's hit done. And let's open the app right here. So you can set video feeding, how much feeding, pet name, the total of times, and how many times, how much portions you want to feed, and all that. And the next feeding, how many hours. Today, feeding portions. Next feeding, manual feeding. Right, so this is cool that you could um, listen from away from home. You could record video, you could speak. You could even take photos through this camera here. Very nice. All right, so let's see manual feed. Five. There you go. Go, Toby. Yeah, this dog will get scared of anything, but he'll get used to it. So you could add when the next feeding will be and how many portions. You want five portions of, let's say my dog is not that heavy, so it's going to be like 30 grams. 30 grams, all right. Done. Whenever it's the next feed, you could re uh, add the recording. And uh, let me see. It's a military time, so 20, going to be like around 8 p.m. That's the next meal. Add it up, so I got one at 1,600 and 2,000. It'll be nice if you could add another dog, but I don't see the options on adding another dog. This is automatic feed. If you want manually feed, just go over here and press. And this is the information. The video, you will see. This is up there in the kitchen. You can speak to it, you can listen to it. Whatever photo you wanna take with this one, you could also, on the gallery, watch everything you have taken. And if you wanna take video. Very simple and very cool way you have a menu here to manage different settings. 
Can you press the button under this review that way I know someone watched the video? Can you help my channel by subscribing? Gladly appreciate it. Thank you for watching.